Hi, it's Dr. Centeno, and this is the How to Rehab from CCI series, part two, where we're getting into rehab strategies and going to do a deep dive today into proprioception or position sense and what that means. So I want you to like, comment, share, and subscribe because that's how we get this information out to more patients like you and help more people. So this is a three-part series. This is the rehab strategies part of this three-part series, and we're doing a deep dive today into proprioception or position sense. So rehab strategies are things like chiropractic, exercise, curve correction, etc. Interventions are things like image-guided injections, orthobiologics, surgery, etc. So what is proprioception? This means position sense. In your neck, it's the coordination between the upper neck, the eyes, and the vestibular system. And your upper neck facet joints control that proprioception along with a bunch of upper neck muscles. So normal balance is achieved from inputs from your neck, your inner ear, and your eye. And the upper neck facet joints control that position sense or proprioception. Now the upper cervical muscles like the suboccipitals and sternocleidomastoids also help control and provide inputs into that position sense. There's a couple things you can do here. At its simplest, if you're relatively low level, then try the simple neck eye exercises that we have on the Centeno Schultz site. You can try those exercises and try to slowly build up both your neck position sense and the strength of your suboccipital muscles. Now, if you can't tolerate this, then you can't move forward. And these are graded from lowest level to the highest level simple exercises. And if you can't do that, that's okay. You may need things like posterior injections or PICL, depending on what type of CCI you have. Now, if you can do that, and you've still got visual issues that you notice, i.e. hard time reading, maybe walking down an aisle or looking at stuff makes you really dizzy, driving in a car makes you dizzy, you might consider formal vision therapy where you can actually start to address those issues with a vision therapy optometrist. You can also consider vestibular therapy as well. And vestibular therapy is where you would go see a vestibular therapist who might help with some of these things as well. Just realize that those folks are a little bit more focused on the inner ear and your issue is likely in the upper neck. And then there's more challenging things out there as well. You can do gyro stim, which is a specialized piece of equipment where you sit in this chair and it's a little bit crazy, right? They're gonna move you around to different positions. And then you've got to work on your eye-hand coordination and hit various targets. I found many patients who are higher level patients who can tolerate something like this actually do pretty well and it kind of makes their systems bomb-proof. So in summary, proprioception means position sense. You need to thread the needle with all of these types of intervention. So if they're too much, then back off. Start slow and try to advance. And if you can't advance, again, that's where precise orthobiologic injections might be needed. So I want you to like, comment, share, and subscribe because that's how we get this out to more patients like you. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.